I'm here today. I'm going to test out my new vest cam uh, with the GoPro as I spray a lawn. So this is one of my mansions I'll be doing today. This is a side shot. I actually have to spray the other side of the driveway and when I drive by that you'll see the other side. Anyway, um, so what I'm spraying today in my tank, it's got weed killer because there, there's dandelions, there's clovers, um, you know, here are the dandelions. Um, and we just started watering the lawn too, um, just last week. So it's only been watered a few times so far this year. So I've got a weed killer. It's actually called Speed Zone, which is known, um, as far as I know, as the best weed killer that you can put in your mix. Um, it's got like four or five modes of kill. Um, so, so it works really good. And you know, when you're dealing with these high end customers, um, you can't, you can't go with the cheap stuff. Um, and then we also have fertilizer. So it's got, um, iron in this mix and nitrogen. So nitrogen, iron, speed zone, weed killer, and a surfactant that actually sticks with whatever whatever you touch, you spray, it'll stick on there. So that's the surfactant that we use for that. So, and then, you know, I'm gonna, actually here's a, a label of the speed zone right there. Um, by law, you're supposed to carry that with you. We actually have it on our phone too, just in case. And, and that'll work too, but I like to have it on paper just in case I get an old school um, what an agent that, that pulls me over or something. Anyway, so we'll see how this goes with the new GoPro chest cam. Here's the nitrogen I use, also known as urea. Um, really fine powder-like um, and it dissolves in the water really good. So that's my nitrogen. And here's the iron bucket. It comes in a five gallon bucket. The iron does. There's that. And here's the surfactant I use. It's a sticker spreader. Actually, it's just a spreader. There's a brand called Sticker Spreader that is probably the most popular um, but but this works just as good and it's like less than half the cost again this just you put it in your mix and it just sticks to everything you spray so the whatever you put in there works better because it's actually sticking to the plant um, so the weed killer works a lot better the fertilizer works better all it does is enhances your mix so that's what those are
So I, I just finished spraying this lawn and now I'm gonna put a lawn sign. See, I like to put it on the corner of the driveway so when people are pulling up or pulling in, they see it as they go into their driveway. Quick mention about these lawn signs. Um, if you forget to put one down and you drive away, um, which happens, I, I've done it in the past. If you forget to put the lawn sign down and you drive away, do not turn around and go back and just put a lawn sign down. Um, because if that's the only time the homeowner sees you put a lawn sign down, they're gonna think that you were ghosting. That means you just showed up to the house, put a lawn sign down, and then you charge them. And if they didn't see you spray the lawn, um, you know, they make a big deal about it. They could even, they've even, I don't know if you've heard on the news, like people, other companies doing that. People get pissed. So I would rather just not put the lawn sign up at all and, and put it down as a note on the invoice. Say, hey, we sprayed it this day, but we totally forgot to put a lawn sign down. We apologize about that. Um, then turn around after realizing it because if the homeowner sees you just put the lawn sign down, um, I don't know, you're just asking for trouble. So anyway, talk to you later.